This place first, we'll yeah. then talk to you that time. The defending champion! Slaying yeah. the previous guy with Balins and Muters. He is Masingle. Masingle. <laughs> that was my... The Terminator music. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, what about the other guy? <laughs> Alright, spawning in the top left. It is our Protoss player for Metagame Gods. Spawning his Protoss, it's Aquatus. Aquatus. Yeah. Yeah, Aquatus. Let's call him that. Equitus. Equitus, yeah. Yeah, let's call him Equitus. Makes sense. Yeah, good enough for me. Makes sense. Sounds like equity, so I'm gonna be I'm happy with that. <laughs> anyway, um what was I saying? Yeah, this guy on ladder, oh my god, he hit a goal base for me on um Inferno Pools. I scouted it with my probe, I'm like, okay. I'm just gonna do a dumb four gate, yeah. I guess. And he went one base baby <laughs> oil. I'm like, what? <laughs> what is it there for? <laughs> um, and, and, and then uh, Wait, did he the cancel? No, no, he kept the, he kept the um, hatchery, right? Cancel. But then, uh, but then he t tells oh. me afterwards, like, oh, sorry, I thought I thought you didn't see my goal base. I'm like, that's when you make drones. That's when you make them up. It doesn't make sense. It's like oh. you thought I was one basing, so I did. <laughs> like it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> that's the best. <laughs> Uh, looks uh, like um, oh, this is a hatch block here. For Nexus first here. Yeah, why hatch box? This is gonna oh, be is really it? nasty. Yeah, look, the pylons in the, um in uh, what do you call it? In oh, the, the pylon position. block. Yeah. Yeah, and it's also so yeah. That's oh, what I mean. Pylon block. I think he just wants to delay long enough. He wants mm. to he wants you to go eventually like for a pull and hatch. He doesn't want you to go something too crazy <laughs> because he is going Nexus first. Yeah. So Quest actually went Nexus first. So and um, the like single's gonna, go gonna have this pull up, so he should be able to apply some pressure. Yeah. This is going to be yeah. pretty good actually. Forge Expand does really well against speeding openings in general. And you did see speeding opening from um, a single early on with 1 1 upgrades. So, yeah, we're going to see a pretty long yeah. game, I think. It's looking like it. What do you think about this looking now, PvZ? Like <laughs> for, for what? For PvZ. PvT. Uh, uh, PvZ. PvZ. Yeah. Um, I honestly don't know about this mo map at all, apart from the expansion pattern is unusual like generally like you can take that as a fourth if you're playing defensive but if you want to play like an offensive style like blink you can take like that base instead mm, true and it kind of gives you more map control it's it's weird it's really odd i don't know like it's just uh, i have been having a lot of fun yeah. i've been having a lot of fun with I've a lot of portions found... on this map J just for the record yeah. i have been having like a I've lot of fun with found... <laughs> yeah yeah it's Definitely a very different map. I like how there's like so many ramps around. It's actually pretty good for borrowed banelings, as I've learned the hard way, and it's really good for like <laughs> link surrounds. Sentries actually don't do too bad either. Oh, he's gonna counter us. Like, around a ramp. <laughs> he's gonna try and counter us. Oh my god. Right? This doesn't work right against the Zerg <laughs> at this point. At like, five yeah. minutes! I mean, he's gonna have two it's queens so out. Yeah, it's, I think the queens alone power how the cannon with any form of Zerg support. Yeah. Oh well. He might even force a cancel. But I don't think he's gonna see the pylon. No, no, he won't, yeah. he won't see it now because he's not looking for it. But he might. Oh, he's tucked one in in a good position. It's not a good place to tuck one in. I think I, th I think this is gonna force him to cancel. Actually, yeah, if he overreacts, he doesn't have to cancel maybe. this. He doesn't have to cancel it though, that's the issue. He could overpower this with the units he has. Mm. I mean, it'll take a while for the hatchery yeah. to go down, so. Hmm. Interesting. Well, I mean, he, he's trying to play dirty at this point, he's trying to throw this like, off guard. Oh yeah, he's playing. He's playing the skill toss right here. Absolutely. Next, this into oh, it doesn't get the castle. Oh no, that's good. That's actually for the best. He doesn't want to cancel that. So yeah, let's see if he moves his queens over now. Yeah. Oh, looks like he's trying to abandon it right now. The hatch is dead, really. Yeah, he's trying to go for roaches. He's he's abandoned it. He's just slow looked at it like, okay, you went for three cannons and a pylon. I can I can afford that. I'll yeah. just make some drones out of here. Hopefully these drones do survive. Yeah. Worth, yeah. If he actually went for like a Nidus Worm right now and just went straight into the main, I mean, what would Equatus do? Oh, I mean... I reckon he could punish it really bad. Maybe, maybe. It's a probably a reason take a while, you don't though. see this stuff in pro games. Yeah. So, the thing is, Nidus will take yeah. a while. He doesn't have Leia right now. He, if he tries to go for a bust, which I think that's what he's thinking of doing, like it wouldn't work against a forge and a ramp. So yeah, it looks like he's just gonna... Yeah. Actually, he's not taking his third base at all. He's just making a lot of wretches. He might, he might be thinking about going for a bust. Yeah. Uh, I don't know how I feel about this. Roach, uh, Roach with speedings behind us. Yeah. Against force fields. <laughs> <laughs> and a robot. He doesn't really have much of an 
other of a choice after losing that third. That was pretty massive. Yeah, uh, it looks like he is thinking of getting a third. The queen is moving to a funny place right now. What the? What the? Uh, What's the queen doing? Okay. He's gonna find a probe. Oh, actually, gets trapped by the pylon. Look at that! <laughs> wow. <laughs> the queen gets trapped by the pylon. That's that's just a manor pylon. Right? I know, right? <laughs> that's not that's not even like <laughs> sensible. I mean, that's the queen shouldn't be out there in the first place. But he managed to catch her somehow. Catch her. Warping the zealot, yeah. gang, the, gang the queen, <laughs> gang the queen. Oh no, the warp gate isn't finished. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, yeah, that was that was just a troll move. <laughs> yeah, that was Larry. <laughs> but it looks like he's gonna follow so, yeah, the water like... push. I think. Yeah. I mean, cannons he's got, already he's defending. Got a, a oh, but bailing is coming up. Ooh, yeah. ooh, bailing Roach versus Immortals. Can he blow up the sentries or not? That's the real question. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's ex all that really matters. Yeah. The thing mm. is, if the Protoss Force builds like really well, then there's not really a whole lot this comp can do. Mm. The thing is, there's a lot of high so ground. I wonder if areas, he's gonna try so... clear the cannons. Uh, yeah, maybe. I mean, the cannons tell me he's going for like, a gonna try to kill the cannons. Yeah. Oh no, no, he should leave that. Yeah. <laughs> there's no reason to kill that right now. I, I guess there's one pylon, but like, yeah. it's not worth it at this point. He's staying on two bases, so do you really want to waste units killing that stuff? Yeah, exactly. He could just take the like here as a third, mm. like the the one to the left, the base to the left. Yeah, absolutely. Well, for now, we're gonna see him want to push. Coming yeah, up. when you see that many cannons, you know they're gonna Just do a two base on you. It's like, what else can you want? It's like I don't want you to run in my base. Well, your pro yeah. your army probably won't be at home then for something. Yeah. Look at the gate count. It's four gates. Six. That is a lot of gates. You actually have plus one plus Six. one for this. So this is actually a pretty terrifying push. And yeah, and he's getting that more lot too. Yeah, he will be beating the Zerg supply. Probably over probed a little bit. Uh, yeah, a little bit, but that's not. He's executing deal. this pretty well apart. Yeah, I mean, he'll he'll over. I think he made too many probes. Maybe, but he could just use that for a yeah. transfer if it doesn't work anyway. The thing is, he'll beat the Zerg in supply yeah, exactly. in a few seconds. So the thing is, I don't know if I don't know if he yeah. even needs to do this. He could just wait and kill him eventually. In fact, <laughs> my single's yeah, about to like single's actually run just... into him. Yeah, exactly. Well, uh, it's all really gonna come down to these banes, really. Yeah, against three the cannons, have the fields. firepower to kill everything. Mm. Yeah, he's not gonna bust, but maybe the Protoss will move out and get caught. I don't. I yeah, maybe don't know. maybe he catches him wise on the low ground, but a probe already sees his army, so it's gonna stay home. Uh, I think it's over at this point. Yeah, <laughs> he's even getting shield upgrades. <laughs> it's like why not? Target the forge for BM. Nope, force field. Uh, force field, pretty oh, good. Oh, kills the cannon on the pylon and. Hurt to zealot, but that was always banning. So now he has no way of breaking the ramp. All right. Um, yeah. I think uh, that's where the white flag is called. He the forge. He might. He, he has an overseer, so he has vision of that, so he might be able to snipe on the low ground. But then he gets forced wood in, and you lose all yeah. your riches. So. Yeah. Oh, he's exactly. gonna go for another banning point. push. Oh, okay. It's a, yeah. Oh, he's. he's Aquidus is a bit scared of him. Masingo very intimidating with his banings. He just killed a terror with him, with only banings. <laughs> That was talk. terrifying. Yeah, exactly. Oh, four zealots oh, coming in! Just... It's gonna, this is gonna put a timer on him. Oh, no. The spine caller here that's gonna fight off these four zealots by themselves. Actually, zealots are just gonna ignore him and assassinate the queen. In the meantime, four zealots do block this, no problem. Where are these zealots going? Fight, damn you, fight! There you go. So, yeah, queen gets assassinated. It's gonna force the entire army back. Oh my god, my single. He, he is. does have a spine crawler, though. It's... Yeah, but. They could just target a drone and a queen at this point. He will actually lose the queen now. Ugh. It did enough mm. damage by the four zealots already. Well, we just have to wait for the immortals to bank up. I think he's actually got four immortals now, almost. This is the fourth one coming out. So yeah. yeah he's, in a, he's in a really, really good position. Yeah, well, he's out supplied. He, he has a high supply than a single right now. <laughs> like, he's getting Colossus tech as well, so <laughs> I don't know. He's mathematically ahead at this point. If win. AEQ doesn't win, okay, what's that supposed to mean, Slayer? I don't know, man. You what's see that nothing. supposed? How can he? How can he not win from here, like Slayer? Maybe. A bit of. <laughs> I don't know. The answer. Maybe if he force fielded himself inside <laughs> and Overlord's drop bailings on the donut from inside, <laughs> maybe <laughs> that could work. Yeah. There's like a two partner. It's a two-player deal. Tsk, tsk. <laughs> Sounds like Slayer's trash talking. Yeah. Our favorite Zerg. <laughs>
Yeah. I'm very disappointed. I know. Man. Oh, just chatting gonna... with the team. Yeah. This is why I left MGG. <laughs> <laughs> just saying. <laughs> uh, All right. Oh so yeah, anyway, Colossus yeah. coming down. Hydra's... Third base. It's gonna be Hydra Roach versus a Colossus Army with force fields. Uh, well, I'm not a fortune teller, but I think I know what's gonna happen. I think uh, the Hydra. No, Hydra's are pretty good. Against force fields? You never know. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Maybe if he misses the force fields and guiding shields ten times, even then he will still win, but this is a high supply. Yeah, true. Maybe if he sits under the rocks and gets killed. Oh, actually, he's gonna catch a co No, he's not. Force fields. And he loses oh, half the army. Oh, god. The rest have to run with their tails behind them. Some zealots yelling and chasing after them. Gonna get a Hydra maybe for his trouble, especially because charge is finished. Yeah. Get back here. But yeah. And I think it's over. Down in supply, down in economy, 50 supply down overall, and inferior tech. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> leave, just leave SC2C. Okay. Just leave. We put you on a spaceship and like change your name and shit. Just never heard of you again. Yeah. I'll just make a new account. I'm playing all the BSGs. <laughs> As a uh, Alright, anyway, here comes the uh, death ball, the death march. It's gonna, gonna tie the series up. Hopefully. Yeah, <laughs> if Zerg wins from here, it. I'll be very surprised. I'll be very pleasantly surprised, but... Yeah. I don't think it'll work. Mm. Oh, <laughs> he's about to have 2-2. Two, two. We'll have 2-2 two, two oh, against... Oh, back and away. Yeah, against 2-1-1 two, one, two, one one. of Protoss. <laughs> Still even upgrades, technically. With their shield upgrade. Yeah, with way much. superior tech. I think Storm uh, Templar Archive just finished as well, yeah. He's playing this very passive. If ah, if Masingo yeah. somehow figured out he can buy it enough he to get Brew Lords, he might win. <laughs> if. Maybe. Yeah, he does have damage. I don't focus. think he's going. Well, he's got the infestation bit Masingo's and getting the Hydra Viper. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. But this way, the ground army alone is stronger. Unless you blind and crowd perfectly and fungal perfectly, I don't think it'll work. Oh. Yeah. I could've Zerg army just needs to get maxed. Well, the thing is, Protoss is maxed already, so you have to trade early on, on preferably yeah. on Protoss ground, <laughs> before they get, get on top of your base like this. <laughs> like, you want to trade yeah. and then still have enough time to remax before the Protoss does, but right now they're on top of you, so you're not going to remax in time. <laughs> oh, he's under the rocks! Yeah. Maybe if there's- if only there was some Bailey's bell all around that rock tower and it all exploded right now. <laughs> and it fell on the army somehow. Oh. If only! Maybe he fungled it a couple times as well. Um, Oh, that would be the best comeback ever. <laughs> but no, it looks like he's just running. Oh my god, yeah. Oh, he's out of position now. Oh, That'd dear. be Scarlet Marmor, Oh, okay. He, yeah, he's, he has to fight down. Um, he has to run no down the ramp now. Yet. Oh, there's a fungal available. There's a fungal He does come down the ramp, kind fungal. of. Fungals. Uh, e no. Good force fields. Yeah. A lot of overlapping ones, but good enough to like uh, do his job. And I think the Colossus just wins the game for him. Yeah, <laughs> it's over. Colossus are pretty good. Yes, so they are. are mortals. Yes, they are. All of them surviving. GG. And Equatus taking that game out. Getting some and revenge against yeah. uh, Zerg. Well played. Well played by him. Well played.